Brian Whitlin. Brian Whitlin is an American businessman and fine artist. He is a serial entrepreneur who has co-founded a number of tech companies, including Leverworks, Shopwell, Galaces, and has led Yumly as its CEO both before and after being acquired by Whirlpool in 2017. Whitlin participates as a lecturer at Stanford University's Hasso Plattner Institute of Design. Early Life Brian Whitlin was raised near Chicago, Illinois. He attended Glenbrook North High School. Whitlin graduated from Lehigh University with a bachelor's degree in business and economics. He served two terms as class of 2001 president and founded his first software company in his dorm room. Brian later completed his master's degree in mechanical engineering and design at the Stanford University School of Engineering. For his master's thesis, Whitling co-founded RootFi, a new product development incubator, with partner Doug Pat. Career Rur. Whitling's career began while a senior at Lehigh University. He co-founded a custom software development company called Leverworks with Keith Schacht and Zach Kaplan. In December 2001, Leverworks was sold to Leo Media for an undisclosed sum. RootFi. While completing his master's degree in mechanical engineering and design at the Stanford University School of Engineering, Whitlin co-founded RootFi, a new product development incubator, with partner Doug Pat. The company's success and approach to portfolio innovation garnered media attention for Whitlin. On September 4, 2007, while in partnership with Timbuktu, making limited edition messenger bags out of Root Fi's Reclaim brand recycled fabric. Timbuktuo and Root Fi received a cease and desist letter from Target for using the Bullseye logo within the Reclaim fabric. This fabric was utilized in a line of limited edition messenger bags manufactured by Timbuktuo Lamatron bags. This move by Target halted production of the recycled bags, angering many and sparking controversy around copyright law and recycled and repurposed materials. Although the collaboration with Timbuktuo ended prematurely, Root5 was able to successfully sell another of their incubated companies, Go Laces, LLC, a footwear accessory business to a publicly traded footwear company, for an undisclosed amount in February 2008. Idio and Shopwell. After the sale of Galaces, Brian, in conversation with founder David M. Kelly, joined global design firm Idio as entrepreneur in residence in June 2008. He co founded a personalized nutrition app, Shopwell, that provides healthy food recommendations for users based on their unique dietary needs. The company raised venture funding from new venture partners and Idio. He led a team of engineering and registered dietitians to create the first personalized nutrition scoring algorithm, leveraging machine learning and dietetics. Shopwell was acquired by Harvest Mark in 2013, which was again acquired by Inmit in 2016. Yumley. In 2009, Whitland was appointed as a head of mobile and platform of the personalized recipe recommendations and search platform. Youngly by their board of directors. He handled day-to-day -day operations and opened its API to other companies as a paid service. By 2014, it has 15 million active users in the U.S. and was named Best of 2014 in Apple's App Store. He became the chief executive officer of the company in October 2016. Under his leadership, Youngly grew from 1M to 27M registered users before acquired by the appliance manufacturer Whirlpool in 2017 for an undisclosed amount. Fine Artist Whitlin is a classically trained artist, claiming to be the first cyborg artist utilizing his classical training and AA. Brian has created hundreds of replications of his own artistic brain using computer vision and machine learning. He collaborates with these AI artificial intelligence models to create each composition which is then rendered in oil on canvas. His practice largely speaks to the growing relationship between human and machine while examining the role technology plays in everyday life. He is represented by Melissa Morgan Fine Art and J.J. Harrington Gallery. Public Speaking 
Whitland speaks frequently at conferences and industry events on the topics of artificial intelligence, marketing, automation, and user growth, such as SXSW Growth Beat, Venture Beat webinars, Smart Kitchen Summit, and Health 2.0 conferences. He has also participated in the design forums and has given lectures at the Hasse Plattner Institute of Design. Others. Whitlin holds eight patents that are registered in his name. He is the current advisor of startups, including directly Zeal and Upside, and has also served as an advisor 500 startups, StartX, and the Designer Fund earlier. He is also the founder of Diamond MMA, a premium martial arts protective equipment manufacturer, and an Apple watch band company, Arker Company. Apart from business, Whitlin is also a trained fine art artist and photographer. He is also a lecturer at the Stanford University's at Hasselplattner Institute of Design, where he runs executive education programs and coaches students about entrepreneurship. Equals equals references equals equals equals.